What's up guys? Welcome to a new video on my channel. Dude, it's ASMR and today we are going to unbox Funko Fallout Final Figures Series 1. Um, so yeah, recently I've been playing a lot of Fallout 4 and it, I really enjoy, I'm really enjoying the game. So I ran to my store and I bought everything that was left, including the display case as you can see. And today we're just gonna unbox them. So as you can see, we can get a lot of minis from the game, obviously. Um, if you have never played Fallout, please do. It's so much fun. <laughs> so the ones I really want to get is obviously the power armor, um, the mysterious stranger, or the guy with the hat, um, the dead, I don't know what this one, the tunnel snake, I think this is a tunnel snake. I'm not really interested in the ghoul or the other one. Normally I really don't buy Funko, but when it has something to do with Fallout, I'm always down. So without further ado, let's get started. So it is the display case, as you can see. Very nice. So yeah, I asked the guy at the store if I could have this and I just took it home. Super nice. All right, let's go. Let me put this to the side. Let me put them all down. All right, so we got five packets today, as you can see, because this was the only packets that were left in the store. So without further ado, let's start with the middle one. Again, I'm not really sure what I'm going to get, but like I said, I'm really interested in the man with the hat, the mystery stranger, the power armor, the tunnel snake, and maybe this one. I don't really know what this refers to, but we'll see. Also, don't mind my badly polished nails today. <laughs> my apologies. I was just so excited to open these up. I had to immediately, right? So let's go. I don't even know how to uh... All right, normally I'm not really a fan of Funko, but for this time I was like, I gotta have these because I just love the Fallout franchise. I love the first two games, the later games. I even have the board game. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm a big fan. So, let's see. Damn. They have been glued very well. They come in these plastic trash bag like. I've never seen this before. Maybe people have unboxed Funkos they have, but I haven't seen this before, so. Alright, let's just open it up. And we got the tunnel snake. Actually, I think this is a tunnel snake. If not, please. Um, correct me, like I said, I'm a big Fallout fan, but I'm not an expert on it either. Yeah, it's a tunnel snake, definitely, with the snake on the back. This one looks good. Like I said, I'm not really a fan of Funko, because it always these big black eyes that, like, have no emotion in it whatsoever, but this I like. Especially with the print on the back. Super nice. I'm pretty funny that we already got one we really wanted out of this, so... That's nice. I'll put it down here. All right, box number two, let's go. All right, that's better. I 
think this feels like it's gonna be this one. Let's see, you can see the gun pointing out a little bit. Let's see, let's see. And I was not correct actually. Oh, this is dope. Wow, this is cool. This is a raider, a female raider with an automatic shotgun or something. I don't even know if I can say it on YouTube, but whatever. The detail is good. Not as bad as I expected it to be. Oh, the only thing I don't like is as you can see the head is glued on there. See, it moves a little bit. It's kind of ugly scene, but still very nice figurine. I like it. So yeah, the raider. We got a tunnel snake and a ra oh. Please stay like this. Yes, great. So what do I really still want? I still really want the power armor, like really, really bad. I really hope it's in here. I want the mysterious stranger. And I really don't want doubles because I only have uh, f five of them, but you have one in 12 chance of getting each. So it's not like one is more rare than the other one. Um, so let's try it out. Let's open it up. All right. So yeah, like I said, I've I've had a lot of time these uh, these two weeks, and I've been playing a lot of Fallout on my PC and sometimes on my Steam Deck. So just having a blast. The amount of quests and backstories in this game is insane and the amount of details is, is, is amazing so Next unboxing of a trash bag. <laughs> I feel this one is gonna be the cool, I think. And I was correct, this is the ghoul. It's like a dead, uh, a dead guy. <laughs> A guy who's already been dead for a couple of years and is just living. They're mutated, I think, like, yeah. And sometimes you have can have ghouls who are sentient and can actually uh, talk and are smart, you know. But this one doesn't have a brain, it looks like. But yeah, very nice. Not really hitting on this one as well. This one is also kind of cool. I love how they added, like, the knees, the bones here. I just don't like the feet, like, what is this? <laughs> 2015 that's a long time ago these are old oh please stay the way you are thank you all right i really want the power armor oh my god um let's really hope i don't get anyone anything else right now But we have one in twelve chance, so come on, right? It ha it, if it, it it's minis, right? It's mystery, so I mean, let's go. That one was loud. I'm sorry. time I didn't feel what I'm gonna get so I'm just gonna get it out of there oh oh my god yes oh oh I'm so happy right now I was getting worried that we were not gonna get it but we got the power armor one and the detail is insane I'm so happy we got this one so this is like a mech suit like a combat suit that you can wear you can get in from the back and um, yeah, it's like a combat suit. It's like the um, combat armor, it's so good. 
It looks so detailed, especially the laser rifle he's holding. And the helmet. Damn, I'm just really happy we got this one. Uh, this really makes me relieved. <laughs> so far, I'm not disappointed in what we've got. I mean, to be honest, I wish I did some more characters from the games. Some things that are more recognizable, but still... Uh, you don't hear me complaining because I got the one that I wanted. The only thing I wanted now is the Mysterious Stranger. But we'll see about that one. Maybe we'll get it, maybe we don't. Someone's driving by with their loud exhaust. I really like that they come in a bag, like a blind bag, because if they wouldn't, I would just be like immediately seeing what I'm going to get, and that really takes away the fun ride, so. I feel this one is going to be the Wastelander, the, wait, let me show you guys, I think this one is going to actually be this one, this one, or this one maybe, but I think this one. And that's kind of sad, because I really wanted this one, this one, you know, there's so many I want. Maybe I'm going to complete this collection, but we'll see. We will have to see, because the store doesn't have these anymore, because I bought all of them. So, finding these is probably going to be pretty difficult, so yeah. And yes, we got the Wastelander with the 10 millimeter pistol. I think it's at that millimeter, probably. And the Pip Boy on his arm, which doesn't really look like a Pip Boy. But I love the face printing on this one and the Vault Tech suit printing. It's like a pajama, actually. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm in love with these, yeah. This one, this one is also great. So, yeah, the five that we got were the Tunnel Snake, the Power Armor, the um, Vault Dweller, actually. We got the. Uh, ghoul and we got a raider with a combat shotgun um amazing like i said guys i just always unbox what i like the most and this week it's come probably fallout so don't be disappointed please subscribe and like because then i can make more of these um i also do uh, lego uh, mini brands all kinds of mystery boxes so don't be disappointed it's fallout this time right so yeah Again, I'm very happy with what we've got, but for the price I've paid, which was around 8, uh, 9 euros per figure, uh, it was pretty expensive and the quality is not in line with what I was expecting, but these days vinyl figures are very expensive, very expensive, like getting vinyl figures from Pop Mart or different brands, they, they could go for 20 euros a, a figure, so I should be happy with this. Uh, but yeah, these are from 2015. Maybe I should do an unboxing of the series too. If I should, please let me know in the comments. And then I want to thank you guys for watching. And please subscribe and like. And let me know what you guys want next time. So, bye-bye.